What do you think an artist is? An imbecile who has eyes if he's a painter, ears if he's a musician, a liar in every chamber of his heart if he's a poet? Quite the contrary. He is a political being, constantly alert to the horrifying, passionate, or pleasing events of the world, shaping himself completely in its image. How is it possible for me to be disinterested in other men and be detached from this strange, hostile world, however horrific, that informs my paintings? A good painting should defend itself, resist the invader, as if it had razor blades so that no one can touch it without cutting their hands. Paintings are not to decorate apartments. They are rather instruments of war, a way of giving form to our terrors as well as our desires. When I came to that critical realization, I had found my way. The great Paris exhibition of 1937 is opened by the President of the Republic, Monsieur Lebrun. Monsieur Lebrun visits first the Palace of Modern Art, and then he sets out on a tour of the greatest international exhibition that France has ever stayed. L'arte, la cultura, i media sono condizionati dalle stesse contraddizioni. Lo stesso Picasso non seppe scrivere il nome corretto di Guernica. A massacre must be painted if it is to be denounced. The Spanish Civil War is a war against freedom, a war against the people. My life as an artist has been nothing more than a continuous struggle against reaction and the death of art. War invaded my art the day it devastated my country. Before that, I had painted misery and hunger, but without cruelty. When the subject of this cowardly bombing of civilians accosted me. It was destined to be the largest and darkest of my works. Ladies and gentlemen, Madames and Messieurs, I give you Guernica. <laughs>